morning children this is saisa your english teacher uh, this is the topic from 6th class already we had completed the lesson now regarding that lesson we had a topic from grammar that is adjectives so now i am going to discuss about adjectives children already in your previous class you learned what is an adjective so it states a, a quality or a quantity or a number so we can learn more about adjectives let us go on to the board so what is an adjective here the definition given a word which describes a noun or a pronoun is called an adjective see here uh, rama is a good boy what is the adjective there good because good is describing about rama okay this is a big building this is a big building so here what is the adjective big because it is saying about the size of the building so here the big is describing about the school okay the building so like that i have two pens how many pens i have two pens here two is the adjective why because it is describing two is describing about pens that is the number with it so like that uh, we had more adjectives we had types of adjectives are uh, adjectives are divided into eight types adjectives are divided into eight types adjective of quality examples lazy green tall still children we have to consider all the qualities lazy clever intelligent small big thin fat and all the colors also comes under adjectives green yellow blue white black all the colors comes under adjectives only the next adjective adjective of quantity quantity means the size or the uh, uh, what is measurement like that full little half these are adjectives of quantity and the next adjective adjective of number all the numbers infinite one to uh, millions billions these all are adjectives only and the other form These are also comes under adjectives only. Adjective of number. All the numbers numbers comes under adjective of number. And the next adjective, demonstrative adjective. Demonstrate means to point out this, that, these, those. These are the examples for demonstrative adjective. And the next adjective, distributive adjective. Distributive means. It is not. It does. It does not have correct uh, number or correct figure. So, like this, examples are each, every, either, neither. This comes under distributive adjectives. And the next adjective, interrogative adjective. Interrogative adjectives are uh, what, which, whose, which describes a noun or a pronoun. These all adjectives they describe a noun or a pronoun. So let us go to the next adjective, indefinite adjectives. There is no particular number or figure. So it is indefinite. We cannot say this one or that one, a particular one or two or three. So here the examples are all, none, each, every, someone, nobody, somebody. These all comes under indefinite adjectives. And the last adjective is possessive adjective. possessive adjective it shows the possessiveness means ownership it shows the ownership these are the examples his hers its okay children i hope uh, you understood how many types of ad adjectives are there in the later class we can explain briefly about the types of adjectives so this is here to explain you because the main topic given in the textbook is about the degrees of comparison Degrees of comparison is the transformation of adjectives. It is a transformation topic of adjectives. Before knowing the degrees of comparison, you must know what is an adjective and how many kinds of adjectives are there. So let us go uh, brief uh, the next type of adjectives. That is, uh, adjectives are divided into three degrees. Adjectives are divided into three degrees. That is, positive, comparative, and superlative. So these uh, these are all the adjectives only, but they are divided into three degrees. 
positive comparative and superlative. Positive adjectives are simple adjectives. Means all the adjectives are positive adjectives. Okay. Comparative adjectives, we will get comparative adjective by adding er. Adding er or more. Er or more. We will get superlative adjective by adding est or most. So let us go. Examples. Big, bigger, biggest. Small, smaller, smallest. Clever, cleverer, cleverest. Fast, faster, fastest. Beautiful. Can we say beautiful? -er? No, we cannot say beautiful -er because it is, it is because it is three syllabic word. When there are one or two syllables, we can write e r -er, e s. -er. When it is more than two syllables, we have to go with the more or most. More or most. That's why here beautiful became more beautiful, most beautiful. Like that, intelligent became more intelligent and most intelligent. Children, so I hope you understood now what are adjectives. What are adjectives? All qualities, all quantities, all numbers are obviously called adjectives. So adjectives are, also, adjectives are also called as describing words. They don't have any word to, come, to say something about noun or a noun or a pronoun. So adjectives are always describing words. Lesson less. You, I hope you understood the lesson. And go further with the lesson and identify more adjectives. Pick out some adjectives from your lesson. And uh, you write uh, degrees of comparison to the adjectives. Thank you children.